Hey everybody, this is Bluto. I just want to welcome you to K-Dog Games, Toys, and More. Enjoy the videos! You're good. <laughs> Hi all, K-Dog coming at you again. Bluto, not Boris. <laughs> Bluto is with me still on these reviews. Hey, if you've been watching the last few, we've been doing a lot of uh, Calico Critter stuff I ordered. Calico so Critters. I said Calico Critter. Okay. So you watch the video later and be like, oh, you didn't, you said this. I do that a lot. Welcome to my life. So um, I have monster. this set and then, well, it's two sets and one I'm going to review with you in the next one, but it's a decorating thing. So we'll get into that a, a little bit. A decorating thing? Yeah. I'll explain cool. more in that video. So this set is our breakfast play set and it comes with a bunny shaped grill. So, um, as you can see, there's a lot of little pieces in here. Take them all out. And a lot of detail. So, we'll be checking that out. Yay. So, um, Calico Critters is made by ePoach. Uh, apparently, they're based in Tokyo and New Jersey. Who knew? Cool. So, here's the back of our set. Um, it's kind of showing the other kitchen set. Check out my review of the microwave cabinet I did. And then here is all the items that's in this set. A lot? A lot of stuff. I don't know if it says how many pieces. Okay, so. Oh, you're with the age. Huh? The age. Oh, that's right. Um, All I'm seeing is on here is choking hazard, small parts, not for children under age three. <laughs> no kidding. So, so a five-year-old can choke on it. But there's no age on this one. Got me. I don't know. You had asked me that earlier, and I'm like, you know what? I'm not even sure, because I think you were questioning if a child would want to play nope. with this. So I'd be afraid to. Let me go ahead. Like this set, I guess, maybe like the smaller sets like this that have like a lot of small pieces. Yeah. Maybe that's where they have the I warning. get them stuck on my nose. Yeah, well, you're not supposed to stick them up the nose. So this one doesn't come with our little checklist catalog thing that oh. we've had. Okay. Oh. <laughs> so, um... I can show you this because there is a piece of plastic over this, so we're not falling you out. You should do that. Yeah. That'd be funny that it fell. So it looks like, okay, so we have our little bunny waffle iron. We have some toast. Bunny waffle iron. The bunny waffle, bunny head-shaped waffle iron. Oh. Um, we got some toast, an orange, an apple, a basket, a couple bananas. Here's a little plate with one of the bunny waffles on it, and here's an, and an egg, as we would call in Western Pennsylvania. That's a dippy egg. Everywhere else calls it uh, sunny side up. Now we have another plate down here that just has the egg, but I think you can put the bunny waffle. There's a little toaster. There's two little juice cups, two forks, a blender. And then there's also a bowl, but I'm not sure what the bowl would be for. So okay. let's go ahead and take these out. And I don't think I've been mentioning in some of the videos. Guys, let me know in the comment if you guys have any of the calico critters. Stuff started moving when I was moving the packaging and I didn't want to lose anything. So, let me just, I'm going to just slide that in there, throw that in the box. And then we're going to, okay. The fork started coming out. So, let me. Oh, You're I going to push it down on something. I, I know it. Grab the you plastic watch. bag already to start putting stuff in so it doesn't get lost. Okay, so I got one of the forks out. So, you can see, A, how tiny, and B, the detail. I want to see you play that. Look at it in my hand right now. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I can't get the other. I'm trying to think how I want to do this. You should have thought this before you opened it. Yeah, I really should have. Let me, oh, well, now the bread's coming out. So we'll just go with what comes out. So here's the bread. Here, let me actually do it this way. It's. Not as thick of a plastic. I am, like, able to bend it. What is that? I think it's supposed to be toast, because there's a little toaster in there. So I'm oh. actually curious. Let me see if I can get the toaster out. Ah, I it can. does work. I know what you're going to do. Yeah, it does. It actually works. So you can actually put... You have something like that on something else, right? I don't remember. I thought you did. There, you can actually get it in. I was trying to finagle it in there. Whoops. I'm going to play with that. The other one. Oh, okay. I think there's a certain way it has to go in. Maybe that's why. But yeah. So then you can actually... Okay, so the to little toaster is yellow. Has a little... little Does it go down to pop up? 
it looks like it does because you can push it down and then bend it over there like that. Right. So then let's, oops, I wanted to like let it go. Okay, so it doesn't come flying out. That's cool. But that is really cool. I really like that. That's why I said I love this stuff because the attention to detail, something little like that, they put that in there. So I'm sitting, I'm kind of putting stuff in the bag as we're going here. Um, so I'm guessing here with the basket, or maybe, I don't, maybe the bread you can sit in the basket after it's done toasting. Because I'm actually thinking maybe this bowl here, which is very detailed as well. This looks like stuff you had on that house set. It might be similar. Oh. So I'm thinking maybe with this, you yeah, can put. Yeah, stay tuned for a surprise. We'll have to show them that. What? Big house. Yeah, once we once I get it cleaned up. So I'm guessing this is where you can put your little bananas. And then, uh, I don't know how well I'm going to be able to show you the apple and the orange because okay. they are extremely tiny. So there's the apple. It does actually have a stem on top. I don't know how well you guys are going to be able to see that. <laughs> this is cool, but this is way too small. Yeah, that's why I think it's You says, should make it look like a unicorn is eating it. Oh, I have a unicorn that somehow ended up at my in-laws that I got back from them at Christmas. Show them how this stuff works. And then Show there's you can do. the orange. Be creative. So I think like you can, I know how well you're is. So I have everything kind of just sitting in the little bowl. Not very neatly, but I think you guys get the idea. Oh, you're not going to do it? What? Make it look like your unicorn's eating. No, sorry. I got the other fork <sighs> out. Okay, so here's our one basket, or basket. That's a funny looking basket, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So here's the one plate without the little bunny waffle. It's like a paper plate. Um, yeah, it does a little bit. It's actually kind of shaped like a heart. I don't know how <laughs> well you guys are going to be able to see that because the way I have to hold it. But there's the back. So, I mean, that is pretty detailed. And then here, am I keeping you up? Yeah, that's good. So here's the little bunny waffle. Little bunny foo foo, hop to the forest. That's about it. And it does actually have like a little face on it. And what's really neat is even on the iron, you have the side, the flat side, and then the side that shows the face. So you can put, actually make it look like you're making waffles. Oh, I was thinking something else. What's that? Like putting somebody's face on it and it molds it in there, like in cartoons. Yeah, no, not quite. <laughs> So, like I said, you can, so it's a plastic, but it's nicely done, and it does cool. latch, and it was really easy to unlatch, because I know that would, that always concerns me, like, once you latch something, it's like, they're going to unlatch, but this one, this unlatches, and it moves very easily. Cool. So then you can have a bunny waffle with your eggs. A bunny waffle. A bunny waffle. Well, what are you doing? I was trying to show them, like, the one that's in the thing still. So you can put your little bunny waffle on there. You do get two of these, two of those, because here's the other plate. Two of these, two of those. So you get another plate. Two feet and a nose. And another little, that one was being all static, sticking to me. Static? Yeah, the plastic. So you get another bunny waffle. Never heard of that. And a couple more things here. So you, we have two juice glasses. Oh my God, they're so small. Sure. You should put some in there. Put a drink in there. Yeah. Pour some of your water so in they there. Do. <laughs> Not quite. And then the last thing in this set, sorry, I'm trying to get stuff out of the way, is a little mixer. It. A mixer. Blender, blender. Oh, the wrapper uses. Blender, that's what I meant. Um, so this part does come off, so you can put it back in. I was trying to see if the top comes. Yes, the top comes off as well. So you can see, but it doesn't. Can you put stuff in there? You can probably act like you're blending like some of the fruit, making like a smoothie or something, but it doesn't actually move or blend anything. Oh. But like I said, it's a very, it, it was a very cute set. It wasn't that cool. expensive, so... Um, like I said, I just love the detail they do on these, and this is where it's going to, to be safe for now until I can get some things set up. Yeah, I haven't decided if I'm going to put all the little stuff out yet once I get everything set up, but um, that is excuse me, it for this review. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe.
bell icon so you know when I post new content. Help share my page. What's up? No bell. Oh, <laughs> share my page. I would greatly appreciate it. Subscribers, watchers, thank you. you. Guys are awesome. Love and appreciate all of you. New subscribers, welcome aboard. Hope you're enjoying. Watchers, it'd be awesome if you subscribe. My numbers are really getting up there, which is making me ecstatic. And um, people are leaving comments, so I'm interacting. You know, ask me a question. I think somebody asked me about the um, animator dolls I responded to earlier tonight. And basically, I told her because she said she wasn't sure about it. And I said, Honestly, if I don't like something, I am going to let you know. Yes, you do. Because I've done. We're not one of those people. Yeah, if we I don't like it. We will. Tell I've you. done reviews where I'm like, yeah, no, I. And we also know it. what the product is. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, because we're. We'll get into that on something else later. Stay tuned. So, um, you can check out the other channel, Bluto and I. Bluto and I do together. Karen and Bluto is on another review channel. Haven't posted too much there recently. Trying to figure some things out there. But if you want to check out the reviews. Uh, we might have guests. Language. Like Bandit. Yeah, Bandit's over there a little bit. He's funny. <sighs> yeah, because he eats all the burnt food you don't eat. <laughs> Comment if there's something out there you want me to review. Let me know. Because like I said, there's some things I'm not even sure what's out there. A couple items I'm going to be reviewing here in a little bit. Um. I really didn't know anything about, and I was doing some research and had to order the stuff. So stay tuned for that. One more Calico Critter review. Cool. So we'll see you in that one. Bye. Bye.